When we look through the history of Tom Longboat and the legacy that he left through cast and recast, there's a lot we can learn. In the original casting of Longboat, there was a lot of negative surrounding his ethnic background. And because of that, there's a lot of focus on his failures rather than his successes. When we look today to his recasting, although it's still not as prevalent as it should be, he's now looked at as a hero in the Aboriginal culture in sport. First, when we look at the original casting of Longboat, even though he was able to compete at such a high level and show success, when he did have times of failure, there was a lot of speculation as to why he was failing. But ultimately, it came down to the fact that everyone thought he was a lazy Indian who drank a lot. A lot of the original casting of Longboat was done through the eyes of the media. The media was always twisting the story by the use of racial commentary and the use of native stereotypes to make all these stories more believable. Because of the media's stories, the whole Longboat story flipped. The Longboat story should have been about a hero who went and conquered the world, or about a gifted athlete. But instead, because of the media, this gifted athlete that we see on screen was instead called a lazy, drunken Indian who never trained and squandered all his prize money and needed a white man to help him fit in with society at that time. Because of the impact the media had on the Longboat story, recasting his story was going to take a lot of time and commitment to create a positive outlook on Longboat in Canada. It was Bruce Kidd who originally set out to steer the conversation of Tom Longboat in Canada. But he knew it was going to take a lot of time to change this. And in doing so, his reputation took a major hit because his opinions didn't embody sport. Because of the efforts of Bruce Kidd, the Tom Longboat story and recast has been kind of positive. In doing so, he created an award for Aboriginal athletes for their sport contributions and a day in the name of Tom Longboat. But because it's only a semi shift, a lot of times he often still goes unnoticed. Some people still don't know who Tom Longboat is and his awards still go kind of slipped under the rug. Some people even still view him as a drunk, lazy Indian who couldn't train himself. When we look at the casting, and the recasting of the Tom Longboat legacy, there's a lot of things we can learn about history. The most important thing that I'm taking away from his story is how the media portrays us is going to play a big role in our story. When he was originally casted, he was casted as a drunk, lazy Indian instead of a great athlete. And because of this, recasting him took a lot of time and effort. And because of this, we now have to question a lot about history and all these athletes from different cultures. The media was different back then. They were racist and they controlled a lot. And because of this, they used stereotypes to make their stories more believable. So we don't know what other cultures might have had huge athletes that are still just being recasted today. We don't know what cultures might have made a different impact in sports. And because of this, history is still being rewritten.